Okay, still got a couple of additional activities uh, if you have time. Uh, this first one is about tilting it from left to right. You can also tilt it forwards and backwards and up and down, of course. Uh, but we're just interested in the left and right stuff. And we get a reading, an X reading. Um, if it's zero, then it's level. Uh, but otherwise, we get a plus or minus reading. Uh, the other activity involves looking at the running time of the program. Uh, the amount of time that the program has been running, the running time. Uh, and uh, if we do all that, we can uh, code a sort of game. So, um, yeah, let's have a look. OK, so in our next example, <clears throat> uh, we're going to get rid of all that other code. Make sure you've saved it if you want to keep it. And we're going to say a reading is accelerometer get the x. Notice we can get x, y, or z. And then if the reading is greater than 20, then we're going to show just the greater than sign say else if or elif reading is less than minus 20 then display show the less than sign and else we're going to display show the minus sign And that should be enough. Let's give that a try. So, from Microbit, we've imported star, and here we're going to import math because we need that for rounding numbers. Okay. So then we have a while true. Uh, I think I'm just going to delete all of this and say if button A is pressed, then uh, the time that we're interested in is the rounded number of running time, which is a function, divided by a thousand. And then we're going to break out of this while loop and display scroll the time as a string. And that should be everything we need. So at this point, I waited a few seconds and then pressed the button. And it said six. So uh, it looks like we just want to display show an image of a happy face. There we go. And then while true, uh, we want to take a reading from the accelerometer. And we're going to get the x value. And then only if the reading, so we can replace this and say reading is greater than 45 or reading is less than minus 45. Then we want to see the time rounded and we're going to show display dot show a image sad. Okay and finally we want to pause for a couple of seconds so that's just a sleep 2000 milliseconds and that should be everything we need. Let's hit flash, see if that works. Oh, I've got a sad face already on mine. Now, every time you run this, you have to um, reflash the micro bit. I got a bit fed up with that because um, it seemed to be incredibly sensitive. And as you can see, always showed zero whenever I gave it a try. So I added some code that um, just required me to press the button. Uh, so that I can practice and look here. Oh, yeah, 
of it happy for about two seconds. Fantastic. Oh, I felt so happy.